Mr. Kovac, you were living with Mr. Goldsby and his wife as Correct. a tenant? Correct. When was that, that Mr. Kovac came to live with you and your wife as a tenant? The end of June. End of June of last year? This past year. 2016. 2000... Or 2015, I guess. I'm sorry. It was 2015. I'm sorry. And then there came a time that you and your wife separated and you moved out. That is correct, yes. When was that? That was July 10th of 2015. So shortly after he moved in? Yes. Had you anticipated that when you took on a tenant? Not at all, no. And you decided to remain on as a tenant? Yes. You have no romantic relationship with Mr. Goldbead's wife? Not at all. And I don't think that there is that suggestion other than the fact that you clearly exercised poor judgment when in May of this year, Ms. Goldsby wanted to serve her husband with divorce papers. Does your wife work? She does, yes. And so she could have hired a process server, but she decided to do it herself. And she enlisted your aide to drive over to his place of business and wait outside while she went inside to serve him with divorce papers. That's what happened. Yes. Now, I don't know why your wife was so angry with you, sir. Maybe she had a good reason to be angry with you. She did. Well, if what you're telling me is she did, don't have to go into it, I get it, then what she wanted to do was embarrass you. I felt that was the case, yes. Absolutely. No, that's no question about that. If she had good cause to ask you to leave and she wanted to embarrass you, that she would take the papers over to your place of business rather than hiring an innocuous process server to serve you at your home, something else. So she tried to embarrass you. Now, in addition to her coming in to serve you with divorce papers, the people in your office, and how many people work in your office? Uh, there was probably about five people there. And everybody in there had the ability to see that in the car there was a guy. Correct, yes. Now, now I have set the story it is May 3rd of this year. You're waiting outside while the soon-to-be ex Mrs. Goldsby goes in to serve him with the papers. Got the papers, he looks outside, he sees you in the car, and instead of taking the papers, you went outside. I did, yes. And you approached Mr. Kovac. Correct, yes. Now tell me what happened, Mr. Kovac. She went to meet him on the other side of the building and pretty much threw Papa John's window windows as I parked on the other side of the building to avoid being seen and I see him through the windows running around the north side of the building and turning the corner towards me uh, with the metal object and a game and swung uh, and ended up hitting the top of my car. How many times? One time. And that's what you're suing for, for the damage? Yes. May I see the damage, please? And the, the estimate, estimate will be fine. Damage. Have an estimate? Yep. Yes is the answer. Yes, sorry. 